Troubleshooting Interlair Discovery Errors On initial device discovery, if a variable speed drive is fitted but a message states it's not discovered, first check your cabling connections are correct. Next, proceed to check the address given to the VSD corresponds with that entered in the configuration and that it doesn't clash with any other device. Finally, if the VSD is still not discovered, check your VSD settings with your VSD instruction manual. If all of the damper control units are not discovered, firstly, check the physical cabling connections and then check the DIP address doesn't clash with any other device. If power LEDs are not displayed on DCUs, check cabling connections. Damper specific errors. If a damper has a fault symbol showing, click on the damper icon and a message will state the fault. Common faults include communications error, overcurrent, motor not connected and damper not opening or closing after the maximum timeout period. If a communications error occurs, ensure connections are made properly and that shielded cable is being used and is grounded accordingly. If an overcurrent error arises or a damper doesn't open or close after a maximum timeout period, check to ensure the damper blade passage is not obstructed and moves freely. When the motor not connected message appears, ensure that connections are made properly. If the errors are still not resolved or other errors appear, turn the MCU off and on again before running a new discovery. If no LEDs are lit on the CSS, check the cabling connections. If the green LED is not showing when the machine is in operation, move the switch to an alternative location. For further troubleshooting guidance, please refer to the operating manual available on the Intel Air website.